everybody, welcome back to Panda Vapes. If you're new to my channel, hi, welcome. My name is Panda. <laughs> and we are here to do a e-liquor review, and it's called Hit That Donut. Boom. I'm, I'm rumor says that it was by a vape reviewer, but I can't find any information about that. Now, Hit That Donut is a Boston cream donut from the bakery, sprinkled with some sugar, and freshly baked, and all that goodness. Um, thank you, vape, the Vapor Supply, from for sending these e-liquids out to me for the purpose of the reviews that I'm giving you guys. Thank them. Ah! Thank you, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it so much, supporting my channel, because without them, without companies that help me out, you wouldn't have any content because I'm not rich and e-liquid can be expensive. <laughs> so they were nice enough to send me a bunch of lines out for your purpose so I can tell you what's in and what's not in. What's in and what's out. What's in and what's out. Um, so we're doing the, the Boston Cream um, Donuts and Hit That Donut. They also have a Hit That Donut Strawberry version which we'll be doing on another day. So stay tuned for that one because it's going to be amazing. <laughs> so what I've tasted from this already, like the finger taste it, um, I definitely, definitely get that Boston Donut. It's, they're definitely on the right track. And um, it's not, and it's also, um, you can smell it. They're, they're on the right track. And the thing the, the thing is, when I vape it, is the chocolate going to be on point? Because chocolates can be complicated when it comes to vapes. It can come out really bad. <laughs> so we're going to see. Alright, so I'm already ready to go. I'll let you know the vapor um production, the throw hit, and the flavor. If it is what it is. If it's worth your monies. I definitely taste Boston Donuts from the beginning, and I've been vaping this here and there, so I cheated a little bit, so it does taste like Boston Donut. Boston Chocolate Cream Donut, sorry. And it's not like super sweet, which is good for them, got them, them which is good for those that don't like a super sweet e-liquid this is not super sweet but I have noticed that it does do a dent on your cotton like I've had this for a couple of days and hello dark cotton so obviously something in there is to well discolor your cotton it's probably not meant for a tank I wouldn't think because of how it's darkening my cotton already and it's only been a couple of days that I've had it in here so all right so I've tasted a few different chocolate Boston cream uh, e-liquids I'm not going to say this is the best of them all but uh, it's good it's a good e-liquid for the price. It's like $13 and some change for a 60 mil. And it's 80-20 BGPG. And um, so for the price, I think it's phenomenal. It's a fantastic flavor. It's good chocolate. It doesn't taste nasty or anything like that. You do taste Boston cream. Um, the only downfall is what it does to your kind. But you're going to get that with 
you can get that with a premium e-liquid. Some premium e-liquids just destroy your cotton. I've seen it numerous millions of times. I've seen cheap e-liquids do nothing to your cotton. It's, it's amazing to your cotton, but it's just how much, what the sugar, how much um, synthetic sugar they're using, how much sugar is in their VG and all their ingredients that they're putting together, and it doesn't have to do with how good the e-liquid is. That's what I found out by reviewing e-liquid soap all this time, is just because an e-liquid colors your cotton, it doesn't mean it's trash. Because I've had $30 e-liquid, almost $30 e-liquid do the same thing, so whatever. But I think they did spot on with the Boston cream. Um, I wish the chocolate was a little more potent. I, mean, I taste a lot of donut, but I wish the chocolate was just like, a boom, just a little more. I just don't think there's an... I, I just think it's missing something. Something's missing. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's just that I'm not in a Boston cream um, um, donut mood. You know, you gotta be in a mood for something like this. For a chocolate e-liquid. You definitely have to be in the mood. Because chocolate is a unique e-liquid e flavor. And it can come across rich. And I don't know. That's my opinion. I just, I think for the price, for thir almost $14, I think you're getting a deal and you're getting a very good Boston cream um, donut. Definitely think that they, what they were trying to achieve, they achieved. So for the price, I think you're getting a fantastic e-liquid. Um, it doesn't have no throw hit whatsoever. The clouds are fine. They're great. They're, I mean, they're nothing to write home about. But that also can be my build, you know. Um, but yeah, I definitely think it's worth going out and checking out. If you are, you don't have enough money to buy like a, you know, that top notch Boston cream e liquid, that, that's amazing. But you have enough to get this then get this because it is a good e-liquid it's very good it's just kind of um mute like low tone balsam cream it's not really like boom in your face balsam cream Actually, clouds are fantastic. I'm going to take that back. <laughs> but yeah, if you're looking for a mild Boston cream donut, this is for you because it isn't, like I said, a, a really rich, crazy e-liquid. It is a mild vape. It's very mild with the sh sweetness, with the chocolate. You know, you get that donut. You get the cream on the exhale. I think it's good. It's is it for me? No, because I just like sweeter e liquids and I like stuff that like kind of like knocks me out. Um, but for if I was a Boston cream lover, I'm not even I don't even like Boston cream donuts. So but if I was a Boston cream donut fan, this would definitely be something that I would enjoy vaping most definitely. I definitely give it that if I loved a Boston cream donut, I would definitely love vaping this. So that is definitely something to say right there. That is my review. If I'm gonna keep it simple, simple guys, um, it's good. It's worth getting. I recommend it. If I was a Boston cream lover and I ran out of this, would I purchase it again? If I was a Boston cream lover, Boston cream donut lover, yes, most definitely. Would I purchase this ever again? No, because I'm just not a Boston cream donut e-liquid lover. I'm not a chocolate vapor. Like, I just don't enjoy chocolate vapes that much. You know me. I'm cereals. But if I liked Boston cream donuts, this would be where it's at, most definitely. So, I hope you enjoyed that review. Yeah, hit that donut, Boston cream donut. What? 
I feel like I'm saying donut a lot. Donut, 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 boom, 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 donut, 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 boom, boom, boom. <laughs> okay, guys, I hope you have a fantastic Christmas if I don't talk to you before then. And also, I hope you enjoyed this review as much as I enjoyed giving it to you. <laughs> I love you guys so much. Don't forget, we are trying to reach 1,500 subscribers so we can unlock the giveaway. Woo give away and it's going to be a good one we cleaned out our closet it is it going to be a good giveaway 1500 subscribers unlocks the giveaway so you definitely want to help me out on that we have to stick together to unlock it so we can unlock get that giveaway going all right guys i i th love you guys so much and yeah hit that like share button hit that subscribe button if you haven't already if you like this video and you want to see more and also hit that bell so you're always up to date with me you don't want to miss out on nothing and i'll see you later bye guys